military weapons. Welcome back everyone. Today I'm going to tell you about the legendary Browning M250 caliber machine gun. It's a World War II era automatic, belt fed, recoil operated, air cooled, crew operated machine gun. The M2 is crew transportable with limited amounts of ammunition over short distances. This gun features spade grips, trigger, and bolt latch release. The gun is equipped with leaf type rear sight, flash suppressor, and spare barrel assembly. And by repositioning some of the component parts, ammunition may be fed from either the left or the right side. A disintegrating metallic link belt is used to feed the ammunition into the weapon, and the gun is capable of single shot as well as automatic fire. But did you know, if you were to make a 2 meter hole within a bunker using an M2 Browning, you would need 300 rounds. That's $1,500 at $5 per round. It's also been stated time and again by US Army personnel that during battles, the sound of the M2 machine gun forced any nearby infantry units to take cover. Of its usage, the Browning 50 Cal machine gun has been used extensively as a vehicle weapon and for aircraft armament by the United States from the 1930s to the present day. It was heavily used during World War II, the Korean War, the Vietnam War, the Falklands War, the Soviet-Afghan War, the Gulf War, the Iraq War, and the war in Afghanistan in the 2000s and 2010s. It's the primary heavy machine gun of NATO countries and has been used by many other countries as well. I'll be back. Okay. Right here, click, safe, click in there. All right, so we're gonna grab the garden hand, rip to the rear, push it forward, bolt release, push forward. Right. Oh, there you go, bolt release. All right, now you went from three to two. Of its design detail, it features many specific designations. The official U.S. military designation for the current infantry type is the Browning Machine Gun 50 Cal M2 HB Flexible. It's effective against infantry, unarmored or lightly armored vehicles and boats, light fortifications and low-flying aircraft. The M2 fires from a closed bolt operated on the short recoil principle and fires the 50 cal BMG cartridge which offers long range accuracy and immense stopping power. The closed bolt firing cycle made the M2 usable as a synchronized machine gun on aircraft before and during World War II as on the early versions of the Curtis P-40 fighter.
The M2 has varying cycle rates of fire depending on its model. The M2HB air-cooled ground gun has a cyclical rate of 450 to 575 rounds per minute. The early M2 water-cooled AA guns had a cyclical rate of around 450 to 600 RPM. The AN-M2 aircraft gun has a cyclic rate of 750 to 850 RPM, which increases to 1200 RPM for the AN-M3 aircraft gun. These maximum rates of fire are generally not achieved in use, as sustained fire at that rate will wear out the bore within a few thousand rounds, necessitating a replacement. In addition to full automatic, the M2HB can be selected to fire single shots or at less than 40 rounds per minute or rapid fire for more than 40 rounds per minute. Slow and rapid firing modes use 5 to 7 round bursts with different lengths of pause between the bursts. This gun may be mounted on the ground mounts and most vehicles as an anti-personnel and anti-aircraft weapon. Associated components are the M63 anti-aircraft mount and the M3 tripod mount. The M250 cal flexible version is used as a ground gun on the M3 tripod mount or various naval mounts. The M250 cal, M48 turret type, fixed type, and soft mount are installed on mounts of several different types of combat vehicles and ships. The weapon provides automatic weapon suppressive fire for offensive and defensive purposes, and the weapon can be used effectively against personnel, light armored vehicles, low, slow flying aircraft, and small boats. The gun features a length of 156 centimeters and weighs 38 kilograms. The M3 tripod weighs 19.98 kilograms, which makes it a total of 58 kilograms. It has short recoil operated action with a rate of fire that varies between 450 rounds per minute and 1300 rounds per minute depending on the model. The muzzle velocity features 890 meters per second for an M33 ball, and its effective firing rate is 1800 meters, with a maximum firing range of 7400 meters, and comes with a belt-fed system. Thanks for watching. What do you think about the Browning 50 Cal? Let me know in the comments below. Also be sure to subscribe and like this video, and I'll bring you more content like this in the future.